Aloha. This is the story of me. I was born a happy baby on July 30th, 1988 in Honolulu, Hawaii to the loving parents Steve and Susan, two newlyweds from Fulton, Missouri, starting a life together in the land of Aloha. When I was two, we moved back to the Midwest, to Lawrence, Kansas, where I saw some things I'd never seen before, like cows, and grandpa, and grandma, and my uncle Slick. I decided that my calling in life was to become Robin Hood, a little socialist in tights. Oh, and I had a little sister named Audrey. She's pretty cool too. When I was six, we moved to Knoxville, in beautiful East Tennessee, and that's where pretty much the rest of my childhood happened. From elementary, to middle, to high school, and college. And that is where I developed my love of nature and music. After graduating from the University of Tennessee, my partner at the time and I were ready for an adventure. And so we set off on a bicycle trip across America with my good buddy who also happened to be named Zach and a little doggy named Puffy Pants. 78 days, a few flat tires, and a lot of beers later, we arrived on the west coast where we lived amongst the giant redwoods, banana slugs, and fungi of Humboldt County, California. Later on, I decided to return to Hawaii and began teaching English as a second language. I worked at the Institute of Intensive English, where I met a lot of wonderful people from around the world and was able to be part of a fantastic team of other educators. During this time, I also met my current partner, Michelle, and fulfilled my longtime dream of living and teaching in Colombia, as well as visiting Peru and Ecuador. Exploring the beauty and culture of South America was a truly unforgettable experience, and I made some really wonderful friends there. I hope to be able to go back and visit them sometime soon, as well as to explore new cultures, languages, and continents. For now, Michelle and I are working on making a new life for ourselves in her hometown, Tacoma, Washington. It's a beautiful place, and I feel very optimistic about the opportunities here. After I complete my MS in Learning Design and Technology, I hope to get a job as an instructional designer at a local community college, or perhaps even in the K-12 system. I'm currently working as a substitute teacher and it's been really wonderful to see such a wide variety of different learning environments and to see what different teachers do in their classes. It's the year of the tiger now, and I'm hoping that new challenges will bring new rewards. Sure, it's scary sometimes, but as Joseph Campbell said, the cave you fear to enter holds the treasure which you seek.